NASCO offers a special sample bag for the poultry market. This bag is called a poultry rinse bag and is sized to hold chickens and other small poultry. It is sealed at the top and has a perforation for easy opening. After the bird has been dressed, it is placed in the bag and phosphate buffer is added. The bag is twisted shut and held closed. The bag is slowly rotated to rinse the bird with the buffer. After the prescribed amount of time, the liquid is pipetted off and tested for E. coli. NASCO provides a carcass sampling kit designed for testing meat, turkey, and other large poultry carcasses for the presence of E. coli. This kit includes a pair of sterile gloves, two sterile disposable templates, one for poultry and one for meat, a Whirlpack Spessy sponge bag, and 25 mLs of buffered peptone water. There are specific instructions from USDA explaining how to collect the sample from the carcass, which must be followed by the technician at the slaughter plant. The procedure involves hydrating the sponge with the peptone water. Then, while wearing sterile gloves, the technician wipes the carcass through the template in three locations on the meat carcass and two locations on the turkey. The sponge is returned to the bag and sent to a laboratory for testing. The kits are packaged 25 in a box. The next section of this video will explain the various NASCO liquid sludge samplers that are used in a variety of applications.